Welcome to the splash video on an introduction to using a Portland plotter. Now when we want to establish the position of something on a chart, possibly a boat, we do that generally with marking its position with relation to a fixed object on the chart also. Could well be, for example, a lighthouse. So we do this using circular notation. Circular notation is with the alignment of the chart being top being at north, that's zero degrees. And then 90 degrees is east, 180 degrees is south, and 270 degrees is west. And it's important to always remember that we do this and when we give a bearing, we must always state whether it's to or from the object. So this case, the boat here, could well view the lighthouse as being his bearing to the lighthouse being 90 degrees true. And conversely, the bearing from the lighthouse to the boat would be the converse 270 degrees. So before we actually try putting an object on the chart, let's have a look at our plotter. It comes, it's in two sections, the chart plotter. There's a larger fixed section on which is fixed, a rotating section. Now, this rotating section is clearly marked with two arrows and also a grid. Now, this rotating section must always be aligned with the grid on the chart, with the two blue arrows pointing to the top, to north, at the top of the chart, and the grid aligned exactly with the grid on the chart. The other arrow here is important, which gives the direction of the bearing, so that always has to point to the object that we're talking about. OK, now, so we know that we're, uh, we have a bearing of our boat, on the lighthouse, and that bearing happens to be 120 degrees true. And now, 120 degrees, I load the plotter, I turn the centre rotating bit round until we get 120 degrees lined up with the zero. We'll talk later about how you may use these additional scales to allow for variation when plotting a magnetic bearing, but for the moment we've got a 120 degrees true bearing to the lighthouse. So having loaded my plotter now to 120 degrees, I rotate it round and I put the edge of the plotter against the lighthouse here. And I very carefully then hold that on the lighthouse and I rotate the whole thing until I get the blue arrows pointing to the top of the chart and the grid on the rotating section clearly and exactly aligned with the grid on the chart. I then draw a line using my plotter and I am now know that I am on that line and as the bearing was given as being 120 degrees to the lighthouse and three miles from it from my radar river I know it's three miles so I then mark off three miles on that line with my dividers on the scale at the side and that gives me a position exactly there. So I know that my vessel is there. Again, remember that everything on a chart has to be degrees true. Other than that, that's how we indicate and mark it on a chart.